Hello everybody, my name is Todd Wald and I'm a wildlife photographer based out of Connecticut in the United States. And this video is gonna be a little bit different. I've been on YouTube for a little while now and I thought it would be a good time for me to actually introduce myself and actually explain how I got interested in photography and how I started doing wildlife photography. I enjoy photographing a wide variety of species, and I am fortunate to live in an area that has a diversity of habitats, allowing for many different species of birds, mammals, and plants to be present. So I actually took a little bit of a roundabout way of getting myself into photography and being inter interested in wildlife. So growing up, I was always interested in wildlife. I loved birds. We always had bird feeders in the backyard, uh, but I actually went to college for criminal justice to begin with out, out of high school. So I became a police officer for a few years and realized I didn't like it. I wanted a change of careers. So I actually went into owning a couple of small businesses for a couple of years. And then I, my wife actually suggested to me that I go back to school. So I started going back to school at Oregon State University where I started majoring in fisheries and wildlife science, which really kind of rekindled my interest in wildlife. And it was just a natural fit for me. And when I went back to school is actually when I picked up a camera, which was a little bit over two years ago now. So uh, once I picked up the camera and started taking pictures of wildlife, I, I, I'd always loved watching birds and animals. So this just created a whole nother avenue for me to do that. I purchased my first wildlife lens soon after I got a camera and the rest is history. I got a little obsessed with learning how to photograph and observe wildlife and studying animal behavior. It was easy for me to see that I had a passion for nature. During the course of my degree, I was able to study various aspects of biology and ecology, including specifically the study of birds and mammals. I was also able to take courses in forest ecology as well as wildlife behavior. And I use this knowledge that I learned in these classes in my photography, as I feel the best way to get good and compelling wildlife photos is by understanding your subject. It is my goal in the videos that I create to share this knowledge that I've learned in my courses with you so that together we can become better photographers, naturalists, and observers of nature I'm often surprised that many folks are unaware of the diversity of species that may be present right in their own backyard. This is why I try to photograph and show these species that I have in my own backyard to potentially spark an interest in others to look at their own backyard differently and potentially appreciate the species that visit. I enjoy photographing a variety of species, but I also appreciate common species such as song sparrows and white-tailed deer because I feel that these species are also important to understand and protect. It is my goal to use my photos and videos as a tool to help protect and conserve the natural places around us and the species that rely on them. I cannot do this alone, however. If you are also interested in understanding, learning about, and protecting the species around us, please consider subscribing to my channel and sharing this video with others who might also be interested in nature. By creating a larger audience for these topics, it will be possible to spread this information to more people and hopefully spark an interest in nature and folks that may not realize how amazing this planet is. By subscribing, you'll help me reach more people and help deliver content to folks that may not be able to access natural places around them. I hope that together we can learn about and explore nature, and I hope that you will join me on this journey. So I'd like to thank you for watching this short little video. I know it's different than what I usually put out, 
Um, if you want to go watch some other videos about some wildlife, I can put some on the, the, uh, this video here. Um, but now that that's done, thank you for watching. Remember to hit that subscribe button and I'll see you next time.